Hey guys, it's Kaylee. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna be doing some more of the boys, making our way through the MVs. And now we're at Breaking Dawn. Um, I'm kind of just going around to different ones that I see that I've seen recommended. Um, so I believe this is a Japanese release, I think. <laughs> um, so I usually leave like Japanese um, tracks to be like more of the, like put them on the back burner and stuff while I listen to like their actual regular tracks and stuff first, especially album wise. But I have seen so much about this music video specifically, so I wanted to check it out. So we're going to do this one today. I usually do the dance practices and the behinds and stuff in these, but I couldn't find a dance practice. Um, so I don't think they have one for this. I think they have a couple of live performances, though, that I'll definitely be checking out eventually. Um, and then I did see that they have a making film, but there's no English subs, um, which tends to happen a lot with like the, I think, Japanese content and stuff. Um, so I don't want to watch it in this because it doesn't have subs and I did skim through it really quick and it looked like there's a lot of like speaking and talking and everything. So I don't want to watch it without subs and just like not like pretty much understand everything. <laughs> so if any of you guys, um, I think I asked in like no air and stuff, but if any of you guys have like certain links or anything, um, especially to like subbed content, if there is like a version of it please let me know. It would be extremely helpful, especially stuff like this and everything down the line. Um, but I am definitely going to be checking out like everything surrounding all the releases and stuff that I do check out eventually. So um, yeah, we're going to get right into this. I feel like I've seen maybe like one little snippet or something from a compilation or something, but that's it. So I'm excited to see how this sounds. I'm not sure how their Japanese tracks and stuff sound in comparison to the regular stuff. I always feel like Japanese tracks specifically have such a special feeling to them, um, just from groups in general, and I always love them. So I'm excited to see how this sounds, how it looks. I'm pretty sure it's like, from what I have seen, like the couple like photos and stuff, it's like more on the neon side, I think. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, we're gonna get into this. Probably gonna watch it twice, just a fair warning. I'm going to pause, I'm gonna talk. <laughs> so if you don't like that, this is not the video for you. Totally fine, just letting you know ahead of time. But yeah, we're gonna get right into this, so let's go. Okay, and I do see that this doesn't have any captions or anything for the actual music video. Um, so I will be doing like the album eventually down the line. So I'll do the lyrics and stuff when I do that. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get right into this, so let's go. Yeah, very <laughs> neon colors. Dude, Juyeon! <laughs> okay, first, the colors. I absolutely love all the neon just saturation throughout this. It reminds me so much of like the Steeler and stuff too with all those lights and just the outfits. Juyeon in the front, man. This man, <laughs> the duality. Whenever I see him, I just like think the sweetest human being, like such a sweetheart. And then I see him on these and I'm just like, okay. <laughs> But I love, I feel like I've said it multiple times by now, but like Kevin's voice in this deeper register and everything is my favorite. I absolutely love how he sounds right here. This beat too, man. Nah, Chungmin. <laughs> I love his voice so much and his face. Okay, <laughs> the way that that just came in first, Hyunjae, I feel like I haven't seen him with dark hair in a like hot minute, but he looks so good. Plus my man Sunyeon in the front. This switch up though. I love the yellow tones and stuff on their like the gloves and um, shoes and stuff too that match like the lighting. Breaking down. 
<laughs> That's Switch. Dude, I love Chungman's voice so much. Those harmonies. Okay, this? We're not pausing there. The... I feel like I haven't said anything. <laughs> the switch up in the song, I love just that... That backbeat and, backbeat and everything is such like... It has a mechanical sound to it that's very consistent. That kind of just like... I feel like puts you on edge a little bit. But then they have that smoothness with like their darker vocals and stuff when that chorus drops and it's like very it like slows the whole song down but then afterwards when like the higher pitch voices like Chungmin and then Sungyeon now afterwards is such a good change of pace in the song afterwards because they repeat the breaking down um, part twice and everything but then that new like higher pitch voice and stuff afterwards just brings a new element to it and it switches it up so well but the looks in here Jacob with the bright orange red hair, New with that highlighter hair, like all of them look so good. And I just, it is a very, I can tell a very um, like controlled environment and stuff with like the music video because it's only like kind of in one um, space. It's more of like a kind of performance um, music video, but like they're killing it. The formations <laughs> and just like everything is so good. Just like, like their vocals are so like in this part it's so su submerged and like lower but then you switch into these vocals which is so clear and forward and those harmonies the boys kill it with harmonies This switch up too. I love how they have like the first Sunu killing it with the rap tone. I love the tone that he raps in. It is so just pleasant and it's so unique too. So I feel like you know when it's him doing it every time. But the pinks and blues, I love the contrasting colors and everything they're using. They switch from like the scene that is very, it still has the prominent pinks and blues, but they're more in the background and stuff. And you get those yellows in, but then you get in the next scene, it switches to more of like the actual um, whole scene are more of those prominent colors and the outfit switch to the black and the white really makes it stand out a lot. That percussion in the back. Dude, Hyunjae. Hey, Senator Jacob, let's go. No, but that drop. News voice, I love. Jiyoung, get out. Go. <laughs> yes, leave.
Okay, I feel like I paused and talked a lot in that, <laughs> so I apologize, but we're gonna watch it again. But I just love just how musically that song was put together, especially that instrumental in the back is so just different. And I love the switch up that they did. It's so, it has like a captivating feeling to it and everything. Like this isn't like, I feel like it's different from the other stuff that I've heard. It's, it has a similar aspect and stuff to Roar, but it definitely has like its own element and everything. And then it's totally different from like Thrill Ride and stuff. So I feel like it's just a different style that they're trying and I really like it. I feel like, I think during the bridge too, I love how they always just know where to place people. And I love how they had Hyunjae and then Nu and then Sunyun. Like those three are like perfect, like back to back and everything. Um, but the looks, I love how in like the beginning half and stuff, they have the black outfits starting to buy more of those darker neon lights and stuff, but then you switch into those white outfits that really make the blue and pink just scenery and stuff stand out so much. But I just love how separated the song is, but still works so well together. I feel like there is such different elements that go into it and everything, but it just works so well um, as a whole. Just like, And like I said, I don't know the lyrics and everything, so I will look at those like later on. But just like how it's completely silent right here, and then that like that ringing of the bell and everything is so consistent with that drum beat. Hey, I love when they do that. They like do more of that um, smoother swaying motion and stuff. Nah. Okay. Are we hearing my guy Chungman's voice? I, especially during their album, like the Be Awake album and stuff I listened to, I noticed his voice so much more. He has one of my favorite voices. Just the tone that he has behind it is so good. He has such like a, it's kind of like a quiver to his voice, but it's so clear at the same time. And he can go into more of that delicate kind of voice too, especially during that album. But then he can go much more into like this forward, more on the powerful side, but still held back a little bit. It's so good. I just love the tone of his voice so much. Young man with blonde hair. The choreo, I love how they always incorporate floor choreo very well. Like they move this way and then that way and then they do such a good job of incorporating all the space that they have. Dude, Hyunche! First, he looks amazing <laughs> with darker hair too. Do you see Jacob in the back? <laughs> Breaking down. I see hey. See, I love this part. I love how that instrumental, that very like mechanical, just like sound and everything is very consistent and forward throughout this part. But then when it switches into just like those, um, like the part after this, like the higher pitch voices and stuff, it kind of pauses for a second and then it takes like a back seat to it. It's still there, but it's not as forward as the rest of the song. It like quiets down a little bit, which is really nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Hey, I love when they do those hard hits to the side like that. All the camera work in this too, I love like the tilt of the camera and like the pan and everything. <laughs> how it cuts out just those hits. I love how the backlights um, match that beat. Dude, that lighting on him. Breaking down. I see. Breaking down. Shining. Monday. And you keep it to that. That was so nice. That raise up throughout their whole body into the choreo. I really like the percussion throughout this whole song, how much it changes up. That lineup. Ooh, that reminds me of like the leg move they do in Roar too. New's voice is so good and so unique. That breathiness. Breaking Hey. That member switch, like the, ed the editing and everything, is so good. I love how much they match the flashing lights and stuff to the beat, too. So good. <laughs> yeah, that song, I really liked how just different it felt. I feel like I haven't heard this style, like, in a while and everything it's just really nice and i love how it still i feel like has a little bit like of a touch of their sound and everything but i feel like they experimented a lot with this especially with that instrumental and everything it's so good but the colors in this i love how they still with the boys specifically i've noticed like a lot that they really just incorporate very saturation and like very vivid colors and stuff in their music videos whether it be like where they use it with Thrill Ride, where it's more like saturated warmer colors and stuff for that like lighter fun feeling. But then you get more of like this in Steeler and stuff where it's very like more on that neon side, but still very prominent. And I love it. It just gives it a darker vibe. And I feel like they play around with that a lot throughout all their music videos that I've seen so far. But I feel like they, I'm pretty sure they only had like two sets in this, like the, um, the more darker one with like the darker outfits and stuff and then the pink and blue like with the lighter um, white outfits but they really made use of the camera and just the way that they were just doing all of the camera tilt and stuff but then also like the panning to different members and just the different angles they were using i feel like made it feel like a full music video which is really nice um all the styling too <laughs> the outfits and stuff plus the hair colors new that man can have any hair color and look great i don't understand like it's ridiculous but they all looked great. They all sounded great. Like I said, I love just where they play certain members in certain songs and everything. And I feel like I heard like Hakyun's voice a little bit more in this song specifically. I have noticed really that I love his voice so much. <laughs> like, especially, I feel like I want to hear it so much more. He has such a warmth quality to his voice that's on the deeper end. And it really sticks out when I hear it. And I've noticed that I really like it a lot. Um, Everyone does it great with this, and I'm excited to check out even more of their Japanese releases too. Um, 
along with a lot of their music videos because there's still tons that I have to actually watch. And then I've only listened to one of their albums so far, so we will be making our way through those too. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching with me and everything. Like I said, if you guys do have like links or recommendations on where to find like um, subbed versions of certain things that you guys know I will come up with like um, like down the line and stuff that I'll need, definitely let me know. <laughs> I would be very much appreciative. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. We over on Patreon and everything, we're on episode, I think two right now, two or three of the Come On The Boys and Gutsing. Um, and then we're doing live stages and kingdom stages and stuff. So if you want to check those out, definitely do. Um, if not, totally fine. <laughs> but I am just excited to keep getting to know them more and just their music. I feel like they experiment so much with different styles, which I'm so excited to see, especially their older stuff. Um, just to see how they kind of like evolved because I did just watch No Air and I feel like it still incorporates their sound, but I feel like they, you can tell just like where they're going in certain um, music videos and just how they progress their sound a lot, which is always so nice. And one of my favorite things to see from artists, especially when I get to see like their back catalog and stuff too. Um, but yeah, they did great with this and I'm excited to keep checking out more. I hope you guys enjoyed watching with me and everything. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Thank you.